The collapse of financial institutions, the crash of the housing market, the evaporation of trillions of dollars, the creation of virtual wealth, and the decline of productivity are all but symptoms of the failure of the ideology of capitalism. But what alternatives do we have? Socialism? Is there a way to prop up the falling house of capitalism? Or should we be looking at building a new system of economics and politics from the ground up? The first rise of Islam brought into the world a new system full of justice, fairness, productivity and human righteousness. The new rise of Islamic political economy is characterized by sustained productivity that guarantees the satisfaction of basic human needs. It integrates several mechanisms for natural distribution of wealth while maintaining high levels of productivity through the inhibition of usury, hoarding and exploitation fall of capitalism and rise of Islam presents a comprehensive view of Islam as an ideology which comprises economic, political and social structures as well as a system of values and ethics, all coupled with a spiritual filling of the human soul. With its in-depth content, Fall of Capitalism and Rise of Islam is a must-read for socio-economic researchers and business analysts. Fall of Capitalism and Rise of Islam by Muhammad Malkawi. Buy it now at Amazon.com, BarnesandNoble.com, and www.fallofcapitalism.com.